Hey everyone, and welcome back to another episode of the Let's Play series. Today I am at spawn. I feel like I always start at spawn because I don't know, this is spawn. And I'm actually not feeling that well today, so this episode will probably be a bit shorter. So over the weekend I got the flu shot, and I think that's what weakened my immune system, and my wife and I got sick at the same time. So that's a bit unfortunate, but I think I'm recovering, feeling better now. Oh, this train is just stuck here. I think it's just server lag. Yeah, we're on the way to recovery, but I don't want to film for that long today because editing and stuff takes time and I think I need to rest a bit after it as well. So today I have some new updates to show you at the resort but I'm also going to tour a few lines as well. I'm going to go to where Sleepy is. Wow, what station is this? Okay, we can start here and make our way along the DLR. Wow, yeah, because when I teleported here before the chunks loaded, I saw the platforms underneath and it just looked like a big tic-tac-toe board because the platforms go in both directions oh and here's a 96 stock are we getting on the train yeah i noticed that is it the metropolitan line because it's purple handrails devota and cities nice i also like this random texture of the chiseled stone bricks and the cracked stone bricks yeah i know what's waterloo and city Altgate and Resort. That one's the line that's gonna come to my resort, yeah? Hmm, why are the doors open? Wow, there's a lot of different floors here too. I've never been to this part of the map, I guess. Or maybe it's just new additions from the last time I came on. This is the transfer to the DLR. Let me clear my effects so it looks better. Alright, oh, this connects to the high speed as well. That side. It's pointing to the high speed. Okay, so that goes to spawn. And it also goes to Callus platforms 4 and 5. Okay, where are we going? Where's the... Where's the DLR? Alright, this way. Oh wow, you even have the little logo for it too. Nice, on the signs. This is a nice lobby as well. Smooth curves. Did you use the tunnel creator? I almost like this more than like a straight hallway. Just because it gives a little more character and it looks more interesting. Okay, and this goes straight to the straight to the platform level. Oh, these DLRs are only two cars. And I think they're using K-Train sounds for now. And you put the destination and time on the top. Is this a preset? No, it's not. Yeah, it's one of the JCM... PIDS preset. Okay. Nice. I like the details in the train, like the seats. I think I featured the DLR in one of the intros of the last episodes of the tutorial. These seats are cool, so you can sit right here and look out the front. Oh, DLRs in real life are automatic, right? Driverless. And so... Yeah, you can literally sit right here and look out the front. I bet that's a pretty popular seat on the train. Everyone tries to grab that seat. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think I've ever been on the DLR before. Like I've I've been on the underground but not the DLR. I guess there's not really a reason for me to go to the east side when I was in Linden. And I was also very young, so I just went wherever my parents took me. Oh, this is the end of the line. Okay, yeah. That makes sense. Like the good thing about trams is that you can be as long or as short as you want. 
Do we get off or are we staying here going back the other way? Okay. Oh, I can see the corner of the high speed station just showing up in the render distance. And I like how you designed the bridges too. Like it blends in very well with the environment. And these two villages are really close together. I guess that's why you connected it. And this platform here opens on both sides. Yeah, I mean, even if they have similar designs, it's at least like uniform and yeah, you put effort into it. Yeah, that's what I do kind of with my light rail as well. Most of the stations are pretty similar in design style. I guess it just makes sense in real life as well. Okay, so this is the lift that we came up from. So if we wanted to get on this side, we'll have to walk down this stairway and then come to the other side. You just have to watch for trains. Okay, so Sleepy saying we can get off at this station. Oh, I just saw a high-speed train on the left. It was an 802 GWR, so I'm thinking that it's probably going to BTC. Oh, this this side is a branch. It goes somewhere else. Doesn't look like it's open yet, though. Oh, temporary siding. Nice. And then this way goes to another side. I haven't looked at the new DLR map in so long that I don't really remember. Oh, there's one on the wall. Maybe we can take a look at that. There's probably some new stuff too. Okay, so where are we? We are... Oh, it's slightly outdated. So we came from St. Anne's. We went north to Waterloo Gate. And then we came back down the same train. Is this High Street Station? Yeah. Okay, so we went up and then back down and now we're at High Street. Okay, nice. So which way are we going? Are we supposed to get that train? Are we gonna miss it? Oh, <laughs> barely missed it. Okay. Well, the next train's in 10 seconds. Not bad. Okay, are they all going to the same destination or do you have to like look at the PIDs to make sure? Okay. Oh, this train has a different seating layout. These are just longitudinal seats and there's no front seat. Does the DLR pack have like a bunch of different variants? 1990s livery. Oh, villager, get out of the tracks. Uh-oh. <laughs> Wait, so this livery is different? I can't really tell because they're all red with a blue line. The villagers just walking around like no big deal. Oh, okay. All of them have the same livery. But, oh, I haven't been on Cake Silver Line. Is it open yet or is it still under construction? No, okay. Oh, high speed. Wow. It's kind of cool that this line parallels parallels the high speed. It's kind of cool to see. Yeah. Oh, I noticed most of your stations don't have ceilings, so when it rains, I guess, bring your own umbrella, right? <laughs> Is that like that in real life as well? If you stay on that station, you just become a plant, absorb every bit of water. Yeah. <laughs> Next station, Turnham Road. Do people not use umbrellas in London? Because in Seattle, people don't really use umbrellas either, even though it rains all the time. Only the front carriages will open their doors at oh, wow. the station. If you wish to alight, please move accordingly. I'm bombarded with announcements, so I'm just listening to them right now. But like, if you're supposed to get off at the front two cars, and you ended up staying on the back two cars, then technically there's a disconnect in the middle, because only the middle 
ones have a gangway and then this part's disconnected then that part you can't get off okay anyway i was enjoying the announcements we can keep going now yeah I don't know why it kind of reminds me of Ocean Park's announcements because the Cantonese announcements is a male voice and the MTR uses a female voice in Hong Kong so it reminds me of Ocean Park okay this is a different line right oh we're not getting on I guess that was the same so we're going on the 32nd train to Azalea County. Is that where we're going? Okay, cool. Is it not on the map yet? There's no station called Azalea County though. Is it just the name of the destination? Upper Milford. Okay. Nice. I actually don't think I tap my card. I keep forgetting to do that. Hopefully that's not me in real life. I do have a Orca Pass though. So in Seattle, I get unlimited travel sponsored by my employer, which is really fun. So sometimes I just go on the trains for fun. Or there's only one light rail line, but I go on the buses and go to a different place sometimes to explore. Oh, this bridge uses barrels and fences. Nice. It's a creative design because the barrels have their own texture. Oh, Monday through Friday, 8 to 9, you get 3 free swipes. But that's still not unlimited technically, and each swipe is like a two hour transfer window, right? So we have two hour transfer windows if you actually have to pay for the train. But if you have an unlimited pass, then of course it's unlimited. Two and a half hours, yeah. Oh, that is a bit in, of lag. In Moscow, it's like you pay, what was it? There are two different types of transport you can take. It's metro, central circle, or like central zone of diameters. And that's all covered by one type of pass. And the second one covers all like overground transport buses, trams, electro buses. Okay. And, uh, so they are even different costs. Are we getting off? Yeah, were you talking about um, New York City or somewhere else? It's Moscow. Oh, Moscow, Next nice. Station, Upper Milford. Yeah, I feel like has London has something similar form. too in that you have an inner fare zone. And then and large steps down from train to platform. London has like, I don't know, if you travel through... Okay, end-to-end -end fare zone. Oh, I like this design, so it's a slope platform. I've seen people make curved platforms, but haven't really seen slope platform so that's really creative yeah i feel like in the u.s a lot of places are just one big zone that you just swipe in it's a flat fare everywhere and then you have a two or two and a half hour transfer just a different fare model imagine someone makes like a replica of a haifa a replica of a what haifa it's like a funicular Type of railway oh. in Israel. Yeah. So it's actually pulled by ropes, right? Not like a motor on the train. Uh, I think it's something. I'm not sure exactly if it's a uh, rope or is it like um, some sort of Next gear railway. I'm not sure. General. Okay. I think I've heard about that one in Israel. We also have a funicular one in Hong Kong, the peak tram, where it's pulled by a rope and there are two separate cars and the other one acts as a counterweight when the other one's going up. Yeah, exactly what Sleepy was saying. Wait, where's Lily? Oh, you're still here. 
This ride is pretty enjoyable. It would be pretty cool if I add in the code to customize the interior of the train to have the next station display as well. But that's... that'll probably come a bit later. Ooh, S-Stock. Wow. What train is that based off? Is that an M train? Yeah, it looks really realistic. I almost got fooled. It's an M train, yeah. Really good job. I want to go back and take a look later. Okay, we can ride it back later. Oh, we're going so fast. We went up to 80. Oh, there's another S stock train. I'm surprised you can fit two windows on the side because the M train only has one big window on each of the walls. Oh, there's a siding for the DLR. Is this an interchange then? Or is this the last stop? Yeah, it looks like the end of the line. Nice. So are we getting off here? This ride has been pretty enjoyable so far. Okay, make sure to- Ooh, I didn't tap in, so it says no entry record found. Are we getting on the train? Oh, too late, I guess. It's kind of funny to hear the M train in a different sound as well. <laughs> the amount of customization you can do now is kind of crazy. <laughs> Okay, are we going down to the other side? Oh wow, you also have custom uh, custom signs here, nice. Sometimes I kind of think, what if I added London styled like railway map signs into the mod? Maybe people would enjoy that, like auto-generated ones. Yeah, but there's just so many different styles I could add. Like, I was also thinking about adding, like, KCR-styled railway signs, including the other font as well. So it's actually built in. I know there are resource packs, but to actually make it built in to the mod so you can have both types of signs existing at the same time. I'm not going to actually use the font. I'm going to use something similar, and then people can replace that themselves with the resource packs. So it'll be a... Uh, Sans, I forgot which one is serif and which one is sans serif, but it's gonna be the other one for the Chinese font. So KCR Chinese uses sans serif, I think. Is that true? And then the English also uses this a similar one. Yeah. Well, I'm kind of limited to the Google fonts that are free to use. So I'm just gonna choose the one that looks the closest. Cause Google fonts are are open source or like they have an open font license so I can just bundle it with the mod with no problem. Gil Sans, I don't know if it's free. I haven't looked at all. So if it is, then that's cool. Then we can bundle it with stuff too. Ooh, I like this. It reminds me of Bay Bridge. I guess you said the bridges are kind of similar in design. But it does look really nice with the arches and... Oh, is it the same bridge? Oh no, Victoria Bridge. That's the name of Bay Bridge now, but this is a different bridge. Yeah, got it. Okay, so that high-speed station actually has a concourse. Nice. So if the handrails of this train is red, does this mean it's the central line? Because the central line doesn't use S-Stock. Or maybe it's just a... <laughs> just a fictional reskin. Yes, that's true. Your victory line is red. That's why it makes sense with these handrails. And I think you use the disable door overlay option, right? So that it doesn't show the Hong Kong please mind the gap stuff. What station is this? Oh, this is the end already. So the train just goes back, right? Yeah, I can check out Aldgate Station later. 
I just noticed that the Chinese name of Docklands Light Rail, you translated it to Ma Tao Hang Guai or something. Yeah. <laughs> it makes sense. Okay, I'll just follow you, because I don't know which station to get off at. Now that I think about it, the KCR retexture, or like the KCR color scheme is actually pretty similar to the London Underground ones, except that the white and blue are switched around. Okay, so we're back at this station. And we're going the other way now, because the train turned back. Yeah, this whole system is really cool. I'm glad I can get to feature it, like, in detail. I still think it's work in progress, but at this point, it's cool so far. Oh, we just skipped past that light rail station. I guess the main tube line will skip over some light rail stations. That's kind of the point of light rail, to stop more frequently. Yeah, that's kind of the idea of the server, that everything just keeps getting added onto and things just keep developing naturally. That's the fun of it. This is quite a complex junction. <laughs> Pretty good job with the signaling. Okay, so there are lots of route revisions that I don't really know the details about, and I'm just gonna say yep. <laughs> Okay, this line was originally two lines. I don't really know what that means, but okay. Hmm, this DLR is a white square. Navi, are you on the voice chat? Hello. Hi. Are you feeling well now? Uh, I'm still coughing, as you can tell. Does my voice sound different? Interchange um, station no, for the DLR. But yes, I also I think I caught a cold as well. Oh no. Yeah. I feel better than a couple days ago because I was like just stuck in bed. I was feeling so no, like dizzy and stuff. But like um yesterday when I wake up when I get up and go to school, outside temperature is like three degrees. Oh my god. It's wow. freezing. But and, it's not snowing yet, right? And my dad still still refuses to turn on <laughs> turn on the heater. Really? <laughs> can we just just you you can you can just go and wear a coat. Uh huh. Wait, it's twenty four? No way, that's way too hot. How come? Global warming. Global warming. Really? Wow, I thought so it would be snowing by now in in the East Coast. I don't know. Wait, New York is East Coast? Oh, yes, 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 yes. Seattle yeah. is West Coast. Yeah. So Seattle actually doesn't snow very much, maybe like a couple days a year. So it's like a really fun event when it does snow. I guess most people driving hate the snow, but I don't drive and I like the snow because it's fun. For me, um, I'm living in somewhere UK, but um, in my area, it, it do snows 50 years ago. Wow. But now, no, sorry. Or um, last year, just one day only. <laughs> and it's really just a bit. And the temperature never drops below zero. Just once. Mm. Sometimes I wonder if Hong Kong has snowed like hundreds of years no, in the no. past. I know that as far as they've tracked in the observatory, they said they never it never snowed before. But I wonder before they started keeping records, like maybe a thousand years ago, if it did snow before. It can because like um, I think um, like Street uh, Station. Ice Age, um, I forgot, but because yes, because um, I think um, because the uh, Hong Kong is quite um, how should I say that? Like um, Hong Kong is quite uh, Hong Kong is quite um near to the equator, so. Yeah, but you do get yes, weird weather events sometimes. Excalibur Temple yes. is arriving. Like yes, Please stand um, back from the platform screen doors and let passengers alive from the train first. In um, Hong Kong, should not snow. 
at få en større tilbage fra Perron. Global warming og lade passagererne stige af toget først. You know. Why did they say Wang Jiajie Din when this train is going to Ah Dak Bo? Currently, just go to Old Gates because it's not finished yet. Oh, KCR. I like it. Because it is the final. Oh, so it's not built yet. Okay. I I don't know when will it complete, but I I can guarantee it will be um um by December. Ah. Surely. Yes, eventually it will be finished. You know, just now that announcement reminded me of Diamond Hill Station because they Ch accidentally played it sometimes in the Kuntong oh, oh, yes, Line part. Yes, because because Tun Ma Line is just down downstairs. Yes, because uh, yes, yeah, so that makes sometimes if the the PA system like um because they loaded someone, the files like, in the since it's a KCR shared else. station now. Yeah, they just if, loaded like, all the someone, files. Someone in Diamond Hill Station, like uh, the, the platform supervisor, um, accidentally uh, played the announcement of uh, Tuma Line, and they will play, and <laughs> and they will play the KCR announcement in somewhere they shouldn't. Or maybe if uh, some. I have COVID, so we are all sick. <laughs> shouldn't we in quarantine? <laughs> No, well, no, no, you no. can't really spread germs over Minecraft, so it's okay. Yes. Actually, in January, I do, I do um, have COVID, oh. like caught COVID, from my dad. Oh. At that moment, um, someone is like um, living in my home as a guest uh, for already over a half year because um, they just come to. They are also UK people, but they just come to England for a while and they cannot find any houses for that moment. So they come to my house because um, because um, they are my dad's guest. Oh, sorry, a uh, friend. So, um, and then all four of like my family, all of, all family members got COVID, and oh. and the free guests didn't. Oh, interesting. It is, it is interesting. Um, yes, it is because it is um working in progress. So, you know. And I didn't start making PAs here because I'm really uh, busy on making something else. Okay, cool. <laughs> uh, looks like the chunks are not loading again. Yes. And we can see the whole train and behind yes, starting us. Starting from here, oh yes, you can see a coral reef later. Like the train will go through a coral reef later. Uh -huh. So, yes. This is a pretty long train good. as well. It's like. Like fifteen cars? I don't know. No, um, this is ten car. Oh, ten cars. Yes, ten cars. Oh, looks like we are now slowing down, and ready for. Oh, oh, just pass through that coral reef. Oh. Wait. So oh, this sorry. line goes uh, past uh, the oh, resort, sorry. This, does it? This is not coral reef. Sorry, we just arrived at this new station. And yes, we use the Disneyland line again. Uh, Disneyland Resort line. Yeah, yes. Wow, there's like 10 announcements playing at the same time. No, it will. Like, because I'm quite bad at using commands, so. Yeah, and I'm using like DX, DY, and DZ announcements. Yeah. Oh, and I like this one. See it, say it, sort it. And then you have a diamond sword on the ground. <laughs> That's really funny. Bye bye. Well, the bye. doors still haven't. Uh, now they're open. Oh, 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 so oh, there's oh. some lag. Oh, the design, yes. But, like, um, the platform screen case is open, but yeah. you can't spawn because the train is closed. The train doors are closed, but. There we go. So if someone gets off the train, there's like a dismount event, then the train will sink yes, back up. Then, I should probably fix that. It's a bit that. like bug, 
Oh, I think Express Rail Fanner probably you didn't update your JCM. That's why you couldn't walk through the Disneyland yes. Resort line <laughs> platform <laughs> gates. Next time, just teleport to us. Um, this is still VIP, so I will do do this in later. So this train goes past the resort, right? And you made a temporary uh, no. This platform. this train will not go to your resorts, but um, another line called Alt Gate and Resorts line will. Oh, so it goes from Alt Gate to the resort. Yes. It's a shuttle. You should see the coral reef now. Oh. Well, it's not loading, so I can't see anything. Oh. Oh. But actually, later oh. I can show you where my temporary platforms will be at the resort station. So maybe okay. we can start planning that track section soon. Oh, good. Yeah, because I dug a later. hole underground already. It's probably going to be underground because I don't want stuff cutting th over the high speed, oh. like the platform. Because I want to do um, the, the uh, that same pa platform interchange with... Um, T, so I okay. don't know what that's going to yeah, do next. I, so, yeah. I plan for multiple so, platforms there, so then T can put her platforms, uh, okay. like cross-platform so, yes. interchange as well. This is how old gates looks like for now. Oh, I saw screenshots of the wall here. Well, all the yeah. different colors. Yes, this one. So um, let me explain for a bit. Uh oh, still. So it is um, representing uh, what lines you can interchange. In, yeah, yeah, yeah. In odd gates. So this is Metropolitan Line, Circle Line, DLR in Tower Gateway, and Hammersmith and City Line in odd gate east. Is this the real life lines or the actual lines at the station? Um, actual lines like. Oh, nice. Um, in the real world station. So, the, so, so DLR and um, Hammersmith and City, you need to go to other stations. I feel like Metropolitan can... is better with this color. <laughs> oh, I can change that later, I guess. And, or this one. Um, yeah. And these, um, the walls are from some obvious game that is released in, like, um, Overworld map from an obvious game name, um, so I think everyone can guess it out. Is it? And Wait, what's that two D it... game that inspired Minecraft? Is it that one? Um, this and this, right? The walls, right? Yeah, yeah. Oof. Why, oh, why Zelda, did, okay. Did spoil it out. I just I want to say it. <laughs> I wouldn't have guessed like, it. Uh, it is from the same same. Same um, guy that who creates Mario. Ugh. Okay, yes, this is this is um, the uh, original The Legend of Zelda Overworld. Yes. Nice. Both sides. I actually have not played it, so I don't get the reference, but Oof. nice. Yes, I I just um I la last night um I create the platform free side, just uh, this one and oh uh, and. <laughs> I played it once when I was very young and then rage quit. Oh, we're and actually yes, this, north of the resort right now. Yes, this is the um, old gate and resort line platform. Yeah, yeah. As you can see, it is not constructed yet. Yes, so you can see. So, should we go resort to your resort? Okay, let's teleport there and then I can show you, like, <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Is Sleepy there already? I'll just teleport to Sleepy. I don't know. Okay, well, I I better tell the oh. viewers what's new here as well, because I did change okay. some stuff here. Oh, who put this? What is this? Uh, this is um, by T, I think. Um, she said that this is the temporary platform for... Uh, from Carlos... Uh, for Carlos LRT. Okay, who well... Who put these barriers? Me. The barriers are me. Oh, sorry. Yes, like we are currently suffering from someone like um, randomly yeah. uh, change everything in the server. Yeah. Okay. Well, let me take this big lift down. Well, earlier cakes, cake stuff was also being messed around with. I'm gonna talk about the station a little bit because I made some changes since the last video. So I'm gonna take this big lift down. Okay, I hope not much else is messed up here. 
Hello, welcome. So yeah, I did put some barriers here so that people can't just jump into the high speed station from outside there to like avoid the fare. Yes. Okay, so I finished the ends here to close off the the end section here so that because last time the wall only went up to this pillar and it didn't connect to the entrance of the tunnel. So I did that. And then this side as well. I made some lifts in the middle. I renovated the waiting room. I forgot if I did that in the last episode or not, but I did put um, some I facilities last, inside. Last, um, last video, but, and then... There's yes. a water machine, tactile map, crafting table, and an ender chest actually, if you need you, it. Actually, it should be useless. Why is it useless? Because every play visitors are in adventure mode and they sh they are not expected to have anything in the inventory so yeah that's why, true why do they use the crafting table and using <laughs> the ender chest <laughs> or it might be useful for builders bro yeah. i had i am in my fake inventory well of you're a builder you're now so it doesn't matter and then this i also extended the tunnel on this side a little bit just so that the turn back doesn't look as ugly, and if I have future expansions, I can also do that. But right now, the train just turns back at the end there. So, down at the concourse, I also renovated this a bit. I updated the ceiling, added a bunch of lights, and I built two exits on each side. So there's one here called North Mesa Biome. And then it comes North out here. It is pronounced Mesa, not Mesa. What did I say? You just say Mesa. Mesa? <laughs> Mesa. Okay. <laughs> and because, then... Um, I yes, yeah? and I just record the Exit new a. announcement for Odd Gate and Resorts. Okay. Exit A is South Mesa, which comes out South. here. <laughs> I'll probably I'll probably remove and this loop that Nemo made, sorry. Flower temple. And then probably design how the light rail system will go, if we even have one. So down underneath, let me give myself night vision. We just checked out Thank Devota just now, I think. Yeah we did. So here is gonna be the underground platforms here. The minecart with chests just fell from the sky when I was digging this hole. The North Tundra Tunnel has one minecart. Okay, so where is... Where is Navi? Are you here? Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. Hello. Hello. Okay, so I need to measure out... Uh, wait. Actually, I think 81 blocks, is, it will be okay because... Um, I just measured out um, like four doors and... Wait, uh, four doors and uh, four cars, and it should be 81. Oh, you want 81 only? Well, I'll, yes. I'll put the notes down here just for placeholder, okay. and then you can shorten the platform later. Okay. Just so that and I can center everything for now. Okay, so... So, actually, how many... This will be cross-platform, so you can just kind of like coordinate with T and figure out which platforms you, you want. Oh, you're thinking about that. Yes, it's maximum interchange. Maybe we can try that because that's not really typical in Hong Kong, so I haven't been doing that. But I guess we can give that a shot just just because you can do that in Minecraft. I think Singapore Jurong East Station also does that. I forgot. They do, th do that in NYC and London. So this is uh, 14 blocks and the middle is 15 blocks. So I'll probably pull this platform over one more. So these two in the middle will go. This end one is going to be shifted over one. So that it's going to be 15 blocks between each platform, right? I'll put down some... Okay. Do we want to... Do you want to use the London style platform or... Um, I don't know, but... Um... Oh, yes. Um, I'm going to... I'm going to use... <laughs> the black one? Okay. This... Yes. Um, but um, I have to measure out the the doors. Uh, um, I will do that now. Well, let's let's just stack the platform first. So we'll 
Okay, okay. We'll do and it all just... black first, and then you can change it to yellow. Yellow. After. Some days later. Wait, I think the platform's supposed to be here. Is it? Yes, it's supposed to be here. And then. So why this way? Oops. It is mind the gap. Yeah. So the four platforms will be like that. Hopefully, the same distance between each other, and then you can decide oh, with yeah. T what platforms you want. Tonight is bonfire night, so someone is. Um, let me take a look. Okay, and then you all can put like platform gates or whatever. Okay. Platform. So gates. I just see which one would be better for me. I well, you can use high ceilings with PSDs as well. It's just. You have to make a curve down to the doors. Actually, it would be good if I can make my custom variations of PSDs. Actually, Navi, how many platforms do you need? Actually, one will be okay. Cause it's gonna reverse or, back here. Yes. Yes, because okay. the trains will reverse. So then, here. potentially, we can have three lines coming through here. Yes. So. If every lines are terminating here, I think we can have four lines terminating here. Oh, that would be cool. Yeah. Yes, that would be cool. But how can we like um, Cao Cai four, four lines that will terminate here? Maybe one would just be a resort circular here. Maybe I'll take two platforms for that. John's Resort Circular. Oh, yes, the um, Sightseeing Line Express Phase 3 will also terminate at yeah. John's Resort. Yeah, I saw that. So maybe Nemo can take one platform on the end. Um, and yes, then maybe. Sleepy can take one. Oh, Are we using I, PSDs I, I'm now? I'm gonna use that command again. Actually, I th I've seen some people do a design where they use these glass fences on top. I think that was the old SNR design for some of their um, stations. SNR was that? <laughs> on um, Santa. Um, so like they do something like this and then there's a ceiling on top. So like um, yeah, if you if you extended this wood slab or like make it a stair. Well can we raise the ceiling then? I feel like we can raise the ceiling pretty easily. Actually, easy. is this a building hacks? Minecraft Transit Railway building hacks. Um, wolf one. Oh, 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 oh. No, no, no. No, I think the ceiling looks good. I'm just saying maybe we can raise it a bit. Yes. Um, yeah. Okay, I will wait. I will stack it. So, like, if we oh. use stairs like that and then we stack this glass. Wait, it looks distorted. And now. then, like that. And the PSD will need to go to the end. Yeah, there's no reason to not raise the ceiling up all the way to the top. Ooh, I like this wall. It reminds me of North Tundra HSR. <laughs> Why don't we just use the spawn HSR platforms design? Because we want stuff to be unique. Oh, yes, yes. That makes sense. I'm just stacking some placeholder tunnels at the ends of the platform so that we know where they are going to be. Is the ceiling a bit low? Do you feel that, or um, is it okay? It, it is already stacked one uh, a move one time already, and I don't think it... I, I don't see a problem. Okay. I think it's good. What should we do above the PSD? Should we actually do the glass thing? Yes, yes, yes. I quite like it. Oh, hi, man. Okay, so stack up and then we'll have to. John's bridge is a bridge that Jing Shan goes over. That's what Stack like is. that. Actually, I don't know why, but Ada seems to be offline for quite a long time. Yeah, busy with school oh. or something. Should we use stairs here? Yes, yes, yes. Like that? Certainly. So it connects. And then stack like that. Oof. Um, once, once more, once more. Or actually, should we use like Wukai Sha type, like the Wukai Sha one? To you match. can try. Wait, why is there a big hole up here? Did someone do that? Uh, which big hole? Right above the platforms. Oh. Uh, I don't know. 
we'll okay. do that. Second. That was but... Express, but yeah. I oh. was actually thinking if we made this whole thing open, so then um, I don't know, if we but... raise the ceiling all the way up to the top, then we can it, it be also, uh, it make be, passageways, uh, first, but, bridges uh, over. But, but all of my uh, ceilings here will be oofed, so I better do a backup now. Well, we better clean up this area first because it's like leaking into the water up there. Well, undo is not going to fix the gravel and sand that fell down. You're going to have to regen the top part, but it's okay. Well, if Actually, you set it to I... a box first and then hollow out the box, then you wouldn't have water and gravel and stuff flowing down. Actually, John, I really like the fact that my railway systems, all of my railway systems, there are over 90% of them are actually underground. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Just a very few of them are over, are um, on the ground or elevated. Hamura Station. And um, Lake City and Shaitan Island. And no more. All of them are underground. Well, you have to express, you have to regen the top, or like fill in this area first and then regen the top. If the DLR has destination displays on the side of the train, then you can see what you're getting on. You don't have to look at the PIDs every time. That would be nice. Or, or something in train. Yeah. Yes, but this should be coming soon. TM. <laughs> Everything's TBD. I'm thinking whether I should integrate the high-speed fare zone into this part, the other rails as well, or if I should make people exit the ticket barriers and come back in. What do you think? Um, I think normally it's get out of one railway, get onto the high-speed. Yeah, but at spawn station, no, it's all uh, connected I think as well. We should make it like um, you have to uh, go. Uh, go through the uh, ticket gates and then uh, like the uh, high speed rail ticket gates then back to back to this uh, like um, railway station uh, sorry uh, this part yeah I'll think and about I think it I want, and I would um, express rail panda, I would like to use metropolitan line ones to match my style of like what do you, do you wanna? Oh, thank you, thank you. Measure it out before you stack it, or like, make sure that it's even. Um, I, I didn't build this. Um, gonna ask, express, and also we have to re reserve some places for elevators and escalators. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, we can just leave this as a placeholder. I'll probably end the episode soon as well because I don't want to record for too long today. Okay. And then we just do this like... Um, yeah, you can do this on your camp. own if you want. Yeah. And how about we just end this video episode by just rising up the... Uh, what's this? The ceiling? I think we just completely forgot to do that. For some reason. Are there trains running on this high speed thing? Or I mean the the light rail? Oh there the are. Cross LRT? Yes, it, it is now running. Oh it goes to LRT depot. Okay. Yes. I'm gonna come up here and take the light rail. Oh good thing we didn't miss a train. Maybe eventually T can pull her light rail into the bottom platforms as well. High lights rail. Oh it's only one car. And it is slice round phrase five. 本班为八百八十二线列车前往轻铁车厂。This is route 882 to Light Rail Depot. 八百八十二 I'm quite curious why why he uh, why she didn't name her line to <laughs> Carlos L R T number eight eight eight. Oh. <laughs> Maybe that's for another line. Oh, it slows back down here. Or 886 to say see you later. <laughs> bye bye, Lou. Is it on the system map already, this line? 
Yes, it this is on the system map already. To light rail depot. Maybe you can connect the line as well to the resort. Uh, not that fast. Not that fast. Next stop. Like I don't want to make it to be really uh unrealistic, so I usually make my lines like um very fine, very detailed, so I can't just like link it in one hour. No, that's and good. Yeah. Have, yeah, and and I have another station before arriving your, the results. So. The terrain looks pretty cool here. Ah, uh, this is four points, so we can change the red rail stuff. Wow, look at this architecture. The red rails build this. Yes, I think red rails did this. Definitely pretty impressive. Agreed. Nice architecture. Yeah. Wow. I'm not gonna get off though, cause I'm gonna have to wait like 10 to 20 minutes for the next train. <laughs> not gonna yes. do that today. <laughs> no, 3 minutes. No, 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 no. Not gonna wait. We're not gonna go to LG Depot and end there. Next stop, Kaijin Ferry Pier. Wow, 15 minute intervals. Why? It's more realistic for US systems. That's how bad the frequencies are. Well, in oh, New yeah. York, you have your subway, but in most most places in the U.S., the frequencies are pretty bad. You're lucky to have two to three minute headways. In Asia, we take that for granted, but most places, you can't get that. And I'm quite um, surprised that T make this in within three days because she just simply copy and paste the stations. Yeah, they just she just copy and paste every station, but I can't do that because I'm not doing like um I'm not doing like light rail stops, so I can't do that. Oh. How many more stops do we have till the LRT depot? Let me see. Two stops before arriving. This is route ba 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 sub to light okay. rail depot. Oh, the next station is Shek Ai, which merges with the other line. Yes, we find. <laughs> like someone joked that eventually Carlos LRT will connect to all all regions. <laughs> in... Oh yeah. Yes. Oh. Red light at the signal. Sort of. Oh, that's another 882 on the other side, going to the yes. resort. Actually, I'm considering to make some like LRT services somewhere, but I don't know where should I, should I make it. Like, like I don't have a place that I claimed is mine. So I don't know where should I make one. Oh. Yes, like you, you can. As you can see, my, um, uh, my lines are, like, like everywhere. Oh, I forgot to tap in either. Well, the excuse is because there wasn't a processor at the resort temporary platform in the sky. Next stop, light rail depot. Maybe I can help her connect the. <laughs> Actually, connect the LRT Actually, to the underground platforms. Actually, believe it or not, I I didn't like my uh my my dollars is always twenty one billion because I don't don't pay any fare when I travel on any line. I just spectator mode. And go through wow. the gate gates. D don't do it at home, kids. <laughs> oh, sorry, don't do it in real life, kids. Yeah, in real life, you just you, turn to invisible you, and walk through the walls. 18, 80 pounds penalty or prosecution. Oh, wow, they're using the Disneyland Resort line APGs here. All right. 
Who's online? Wow, a lot of people are actually online. I didn't realize that. But yes. I'm gonna end the episode here because I'm still recovering and I don't want to record such a long episode today. So thank you everyone for joining me today on the voice chat and in the server. Do you want to say bye to the audience? Bye! Oh wow. Um, bye. Wow, everyone got teleported bye. here. Everyone is here. Yeah, make sure to subscribe bye. and to like the video if you want to see more. And, and um, subscribe to his Patreon. Yeah. Because why not? I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Goodbye.